So UA is the Global Undergraduate Awards. It's the world's largest pan-disciplinary award program for undergraduate research students. Um, it, we, each year we get on average about four to 5,000 students submitting a paper to us and those papers are judged blindly by a panel of about 400 judges from all over the world um, and we award people in 25 different disciplines following this uh, judging process. So this is a gathering of our 25 winners, a number of our university partners, University of Tennessee Knoxville uh, amongst others um, and some of our students who are ranked in the top 10% of those awards too which are known as highly commended. My research that I wrote for this event was something that I wrote for my Asian Studies minor and it's a comparative literature analysis of shoujo manga from Japan. And in this research I wanted to find out what drives the immense popularity of this literary medium in Japanese society. My undergraduate thesis was called Applying Modern Immunology to the Plague of Ancient Athens. And I use microbiology and immunology to uh, calculate the spread of the disease and um, see how it could have been slowed down or stopped through modern uh, protocols. My paper was called um, How Not to Read Literature, the Nazis' Appropriation of the Merchant of Venice. Um, and my research looked at how uh, Shakespeare's play, play, The Merchant of Venice, was used by the Nazi party as uh, anti-Semitic propaganda in the 1930s and 40s. My favorite thing about attending this event so far has definitely been just being surrounded by all of these amazing, talented scholars from all over the world. I wanted to submit the work because I had already done everything. I had already made the thesis, it had already been finalized, I worked with my thesis advisor extremely hard to get everything done, so I thought, why not? Students from all around the world, from multiple disciplines, all in one space for three days, you know, just discuss not only our individual research, but like current world problems as well. And it's so beneficial to our own ways of thinking. I've really enjoyed listening to so many different uh, disciplines. So as an interdisciplinary student myself, I think I've been lucky that I can understand a lot of the different work that's here. But still, I've seen so many other people that are um, doing so many different things and combining various fields in their research. I've already made a friend from uh, Wales. I made a friend from South Africa. I made a friend from Ontario, Canada. Um, so it's pretty amazing to meet all these awesome, brilliant people from all over the globe. So the venue for this year's Global Undergraduate Summit 2019 is called Black Hall Place, which is the historic home of the solicitors in the heart of Dublin city. It's probably about uh, one kilometre from O'Connell Street, which is the main sort of um, thoroughfare throughout through the city. Uh, I think the most Irish thing that I've done is have a Guinness. But um, I went around, the, when I landed, I saw some uh, historical landmarks. So I saw the Dublin Castle, I went to Christchurch Cathedral, and I walked down Grafton Street, and I saw the street with a lot of umbrellas on it. So that was pretty fun. My first morning in Dublin, I actually spent uh, at Sunday service at the uh, St. Patrick's Cathedral, which was built in around 1100. And I was just absolutely stunned by just how well preserved um, the architecture was. I would definitely recommend UT students to submit their research to the undergraduate awards because you honestly have nothing to lose. I would totally recommend that anyone who even thinks their project is good enough to apply it. You basically have already done all the work. I think applying for things like this teach you so much. Uh, even if you're not accepted, the application process is still pretty challenging, so I definitely recommend it. Do the work to get you here and then award your work through the Global Undergraduate Award Summit.